Hey, what's going on, all you ghouls and ghosts out there? My name is Mike Macabre, and welcome to the graveyard. As always, if you like what you see, like, subscribe, comment, share the video, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more of my reaction videos, Friday Night Frights, or whatever else I am doing on this channel. But on tonight's episode, we have another reviews and reactions. And coming back to the channel is Lena Lovich. Yes, I haven't reacted to her in quite some time now. But we're going to be reacting to her song, Bird Song. <laughs> I am not familiar with this track. Um, but if I do, I'll de definitely let everybody know. Be as transparent as possible. This request comes to us by Robert Hanna. Thank you again for the lovely, lovely request. Not much else to say other than the link to the original video will be down in the description box for your viewing pleasure at your leisure. But without further ado, let's jump right in. All right, ghouls and ghosts. Lena Lovich, bird song. Very creepy so far. Love the religious imagery though. to do that and then trill at the end. Someone had mentioned that that ball head guy was uh, her husband her partner. Yeah. 
right, ghouls and ghosts. That was a trip. I got a little bit to think about this one, but uh, see in the review section. All right, ghouls and ghosts. That was Lena Lovich with her song, music video, Bird Song. Again, this request comes to us by Robert Hanna. Thank you again for the lovely, lovely request. The link to the original video will be down in the description box for your viewing pleasure at your leisure. That was an interesting piece. It was very magnetic, very catchy. It really drew me in, especially with the visuals. Uh, this was definitely like an homage to eyes and the way the eye moves and sees. Uh, the amazing talent to reach those high vocals and then kind of trill them at the end. I really, really, really like this. The music was very catchy, uh, very creepy at times, especially in the beginning and towards the end. It was kind of bombastic all over the place. Very tensive, too, and not necessarily like, I wouldn't say tensive, but like it just drew you in and grabbed you and didn't let go. The tone was pretty um, straightforward as far as like guitars. I think that was a harpsichord or electric piano. I I don't remember the like the difference between the two. I just remember a lot of it is used in the church applications to add that that certain tone that they have for a lot of church songs. I I, I am reminded of towards the end when she was wearing the the uh, wedding gown. Uh, of nineteen ninety one. I want to say Dracula, Bram Stoker's Dracula, uh, with, uh, uh, not Mina, Lucy. She had this very ornate uh, dress on that really reminded me of that. I might place it for you guys. I'm not sure. Please. <laughs> Holy crap! You're strong in the Lord! In the power of his might! You're strong in the Lord! In the power of his might! The power of God is upon us! We are strong in the Lord, and the power of his might. We are strong in the Lord, and the power of his might. It's overall very well done. Score, I'm going to give this 4.5 skulls out of 5. Absolutely. Didn't have to think about that too long. <laughs> But I think that's going to be it for this episode of Reviews and Reactions. As always, if you like what you saw, like, subscribe, comment, share the video, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more of my reaction videos, Friday Night Frights, or whatever else I'm doing on this channel. But as always, ghouls and ghosts, stay scared. Ah! Wow.